We are. We're cooking with Mary Grace from Village Tavern. Hi, Hello. Yes. What are we making? We have our Hemingway Florentine. Hemingway Florentine. She'll explain what that is when we come back. We are back in the kitchen talking with Mary Grace. That's yeah. why you're hitting words. Yeah, we're just, you know, we're just catching up. Uh, talking about our mamas, actually. Exactly. Uh, how are you, dear? Good. It's thank good to you. see you. To see okay, you so this is called the Hemingway Florentine. Hemingway Florentine. Okay. Yes. Why? What's the name? Well, indicate. Um, of course, spinach, and of mm -hmm. course, we have our, you know, our one of our popular dishes is the grouper Hemingway. Okay. So a lot of the, you know, now no carbs. Like my husband is no carbs, no whatever. Mm -hmm. So we kind of devise a way to, you know, it's not really healthy because it's butter, but. <laughs> But it's we you kind of have to cut somewhere. Makes you feel better <laughs> exactly. about yourself. Okay. Especially it's Lent, okay. you know. So. Yeah. All right, so now so we have, yeah. So uh, our, the golf is kind of close right now. So my vendor um, sent me this beautiful snapper. Snapper is good. It. Yes, absolutely. That's really pretty too, yes, isn't it? It's beautiful. So okay. nicely fresh snapper, sea salt? Um, kosher salt, kosher and black salt? pepper. Okay. And then since this has the skin, yeah. So we'll we'll do it skin side down. So make okay. that skin crisp in everything. Okay, so you just want to start with that just for that reason? Yes, okay. yes, because you want that um, crispy, you know, skin mm -hmm. really, really... Um, so you only had to put the salt and pepper on one side, you didn't really need to... You since can, had the skin, yeah, you can. You can. Okay. And then let me change my gloves. Okay. Um, so Those that, are pretty thick. Yes, it is, absolutely. So now we're gonna do our spinach, okay. basically. So, so Florentine in a dish always means spinach. Yes. Okay. And my, my, most of the Florentine I see in the hey be now. careful. <laughs> <laughs> most of the spinach, uh, spinach, the Florentine that I see in a lot of this is mostly cream based. Mm -hmm. Ours is more. It's gonna be butter based. Okay. Okay. So now, any spinach cooks so easy just, as just you know. Just wilts really yes, fast. Yes, exactly. Just wilts spinach, pretty much. Spinach is a unique food to me. Yeah, some, yeah, some people like it. I, I love it, but it is yes. the easiest thing to cook. Yes. So we'll, it's kind of hard to mess it up. Yes, absolutely. So we'll stand back. And I stand will stand it. back. So we'll put the spinach right so here. That is all you wanted to cook that Yes, one? that's it, pretty much. Okay. And so then we'll use. Want to wilt. Yes, you just want to wilt. And it'll it'll what continue cooking a little bit too. Yes, once absolutely. You take it off. The yeah. carry over clean. So now we're gonna do our sauce while okay. our fish is. So it's just white wine. Reduce it down. This is around. Okay. Let's say two ounces, mm -hmm. and then put some a tablespoon of capers, okay, a quarter cup of tomatoes, mm -hmm. and just reduce it down. Okay. So That's the capers it. they're a little salty. Exactly. Okay. So you don't really from the salt on the fish and the you know the salt and the capers, mm -hmm. um, that's enough salt for the dish. Okay. And then you just reduce it down and mount it with butter, and that's our sauce. <laughs> okay. Pretty much. Very easy. So if we every if somebody wants an easy dish to impress somebody. It's just how many ingredients, basically. It's not very many, and, and we, yes. we talk about this a lot, that the thing about fish is, uh, fish is fish until you put something different with exactly. it. Exactly. And so different sauces yes. obviously make it different. And you know, fish is, I, I like it always paired with white wine, so this is gonna be a, with a good Chardonnay, mm -hmm. with rice. I like my fish with rice mm -hmm. better than mashed potatoes. Yes, so. me too, me too. Yeah. So, you know, it's very light, and you know, now of I course. I think people serve it with grits. Yes, okay. yes, absolutely. Grits. Um, some people also serve it with potatoes. Mm -hmm. and that's right, so you just kind of keep turning yes, it? Yes, because the, the, the turning motion makes it creamy. Okay. So, so you don't it would, want cook, would it cook differently if you didn't do that? Yes, it's going to be separated. Okay. It's like you're, you're like making mayonnaise, pretty much. You're okay. emulsifying the butter in the white wine. Okay. So that's pretty much it. And then once the... The fish is cooked. This mm -hmm. is how we serve it, the village okay, tavern. Okay, we're going to let that finish cooking up. we got about a little less than a minute left. Uh, if we want to take a look, this yes. is how it comes out. So um, she's, you can see the butter and stuff yes. and the sauce. Yes. Um, but so how do you plate it? How do you, how does That's that? basically the spinach on the bottom, the fish on top, mm -hmm. of course, you know, the butter, the sauce right here, mm -hmm. and we top it with a jar of Parmesan. Oh, a little Parmesan. Yes. yes. And what a great dish. Different, easy, easy way to cook the fish. How's our fish looking yes. over here? Nice and crispy. Okay. We'll turn it in a little bit. So we're going to let it continue to cook. Yes. And a couple of the other things you brought with you. Yes, of course, our Maryland, Maryland style crab cakes. It's mm -hmm. served with our coleslaw, homemade coleslaw, and our braised meatball skillet. Our Godiva chocolate port, which you tried, to remember. Mm -hmm, I and do. of course, our, I, I mean, I think we have the best creme brulee. I'm going to have to say it's pretty good, <laughs> pretty good. All right, if you want to try all any of this, you can write us here at the station, P.O. Box 6, Birmingham, 35201wbrc.com or on your smartphone on the WBRC News app. Just check it out or go visit Mary Grace and the great folks over at Village Tavern at the Summit on Highway 280. Thank you, ma'am. Good to see you, dear.